hello 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 there welcome into sage sunset healing tarot hey welcome in on this channel i do general tarot card messages for all zodiac signs and in this particular video i'm doing a video i'm doing messages for the sign of cancer sun moon rising and venus cancerian welcome in happy birthday to you thank you so much for being here so i'm shuffling to get some messages for cancer and I got the Emperor card. So I feel some Cancerians are bossing up. If you're male or female, I feel you're really tapping into that masculine vibration when it comes to putting in the work, staying grounded, steadfast, um, eyes on the target sort of situation, no, having a vision and working toward it. That's that masculine energy, actually taking action, taking the necessary steps look at this man he's wearing his his boots made of steel he's ready for the battlefield he's on his journey here creating his life his path um and and, and this is through the action that this person is taking cancer and so whether you're male or female i feel you're working on your business right now we have the justice energy popping out for you as well there's balance and I think you're about to get what is due to you when it comes to business. You're about to be really successful because you have been putting in the work. I feel you've been putting in your 10,000 hours and so the, the, the scales are about to tip in your favor. Right? So that's how I feel for you. <clears throat> the justice energy. We have the two of swords. So this is Libra energy, Gemini or Aquarius earth sign so it, it could be in the way that you're moving or operating you're using your intuition but you're also focused and you're remaining grounded and balanced here within your yourself focused on your journey ahead cancerian in business so i will take that as a look at this on the bottom of the deck we have the we have the king of wands energy so i feel you're focusing on your business of course you're doing something that is creative here something that it's like you have your hands in the clay you're working on your vision I feel like this person is actually visualizing dreaming creating manifesting manifesting even energetically um, about down the road what your goal is visioning having a vision for your future and you're a very creative spirit so whatever you do it's something that is creative. It could be you're a writer, a musician, a painter, a singer, a designer. I feel designer energy with the Emperor card here. Like some of you are designers that are watching my channel. And you're getting your inspiration through your own sense of self, your own intuition. That's that natural creative spirit that comes off of cancer. And so... Um, yay, so I feel like things are working out for you. I'm going to get some clarifiers here. Clarify the emperor energy for me, please. What is the emperor? Who, what is the emperor? Cancer's business. Cancer's energy in business. So you're embodying the emperor energy in business. Any clarifications for emperor card? Creating, that's what I'm, I'm feeling like. You're creating a way, you're paving a way. Um, and maybe you're the first one to be doing something in your family, in your situation. We you have two nines. Look at this. I feel like you're creating a new cycle, perhaps. Ooh, the ten. Look at this. So you're creating a new cycle. And it could be when it, um, one that has to do with your, your generational wealth. Um, I don't know. As if you're paving a new way. You're keeping your goal in mind. You're going to bring balance, and it could be financial balance here. And not just to you, I feel, but to your entire family. We have the King of Hearts popping out for you. And this is something that you're very um, emotional about. So you're very, um, so it could be something in healing, promoting well-being and happiness. But you're creating a new, a new way here, a new way forward in business. So I feel like that's why you have to be in this masculine um, Capricorn Virgo energy, Taurus energy No, Cancer. To really get, get things done. And you're doing it through your heart space. You're aligning with your intuition. I like that. 
let's get clarification this is for the justice energy considering what is the justice card what's coming into balance justice clarification please angels first guides do help me to see clearly what this justice energy is saying balance in financial generational wealth creating generational wealth and stability bringing stability to oneself justice as in doing the best for oneself Bring out the best thing I'm sorry. What is the justice card? Any other messages for cancer? I feel like the justice card is like literally you putting your 10,000 hours. And so there's about to be your just reward is coming. Your rewards are coming. We have the Maybe you're being noticed. Maybe you're about to receive a message. Justice is served. Maybe you're walking away from a from something, looking another direction in business. Justice, what is the justice energy here? It could be law enforcement. As if things will work out in your favor when it comes and it may make you wealthy I don't know because we have the Queen of Pentacles so I'm feeling like something may, that's going to work in your favor having to do with business or having to do with an earth sign Taurus Virgo Capricorn a business minded person and you're I feel like you're going to be wealthy someone may want to come back around to you find you attractive want to offer you love and it could be this this emperor energy if it's not embodied by you this could be someone else's energy taurus virgo capricorn as soon as i mentioned that they wanted to come around and offer you their love here with the jack an apology perhaps this person is watching you perhaps this person is the one that wants to bring justice forward and it could be something having to do with money cancer All right, so maybe something is about to come into you speedily. I see you're going to be wealthy at the end of the situation. You're going to feel wealthy. That's the justice energy. Look, we have the six of pentacles. So you're going to be feeling, embodying this energy of wealth, vibrancy, happiness, joy, prosperity, success, confidence. And you're about to share your gifts. That's the balance. Maybe some of you were separated from a connection that wasn't really going anywhere fast. And um, and it's this separation with the Ace of Swords that's causing you to really manifest your wealth, your feelings of wealth, your feelings of value, your sense of self. So I, I feel like a lot of things were happening in your, in your, are currently happening in your favor right now. And it's about to make you wealthy. That's the energy here confident and wealthy any other clarifications for justice along with the jack love a lot a lot of love a lot to choose from the jack someone is focusing on you gemini libra aquarius taurus virgo capricorn are you about to have a new beginning or someone wants a new beginning with you as, as if maybe someone wants you to choose to have this new beginning with them. They may think you have a lot of options and so they want, want you to choose to have this new beginning with them. But I feel like this story is literally separate from your wealth story. So this person coming back is also just this energy. So maybe I really, your relationship ended and they're, they're returning wanting to be with you. As you can see over here, where this jack is looking toward this king, but you're a king. You're looking for something else, and I'd love to see what you're looking to. What is this card for this king of cups? Hmm. What's this king of cups looking to? So building, recreating, recreating. I feel recreate. You're focusing on recreating. Rebuilding, re-establishing, 
manifesting attracting love hey a soulmate connection that's what you want and and i know it's going to come up over here give it to me what's that oh so we have the six of cups and we have the queen of wands so we have king and queen of wands here so some of you could be attracting a fire sign cancer aries leo sagittarius this could be a person from your past this this person could be um embodying this energy this could be a person you went to school with all right past energy childhood i feel it's very young or it could be way past like uh, a past life connection perhaps i feel like this person too is focusing on as if recreating reimagining the feelings that they had for you from past energy where is this reading going okay all right i want to clarify the two of swords because the justice something there's a balance that came into your life and i feel it's your stability we have a lot of swords energy here as i said you're currently working on yourself working on rebuilding and um, re so you getting to know more of who you are, loving on you so that you can attract love that is right for you. I know that there's not a lot of drama here, right? But um, that's the, and these are the energies I'm getting for you. And I feel that you're really giving yourself some love and attention now. You're being nicer to yourself, being kinder, looking in the mirror and saying, hey, you, look at you. That's the energy. Bless this reading. Thank you um i feel like a fire sign could be attracted to you as well aries leo sagittarius so and maybe wanting to manifest you it could be this person that's focusing on you watching you and let's see life for the two of swords energy with the moon what is the two of swords with the crescent moon here and the water body emotions intuition so the justice could be you aligning with your intuition look at this Two of Pentacles. So what I'm feeling is once you begin, Cancer, to align with your intuition, your identity, your your confidence, your uh, comes in, and when your confidence comes in and you're aligning with your sense of self worth, your boundaries, your standards, your your integrity, you know what I'm saying? Your belief patterns. This is it, and these things you have to figure out internally. And so you're aligning with that energy and it's causing you to actually attract wealth to you just by knowing who you are. And this could be in the work that you're doing. You're using your intuition. Some of you could be spiritual healers. Like I said over here with the King of Cups energy, whatever you do, you do it out of love and care. And even if you're not consciously aware of that, just the music that's moving out of you, not just no music, but you know what I mean, your essence is creating balance and healing just by you being in your true authentic state that's what i'm feeling for you whatever you do it causes healing any other messages to clarify the two of swords hey the king any other messages two of swords three of swords going on journey Okay, a new beginning. Someone wants a new beginning with you. You're about to have some kind of a... Look at this, another two energy. We have four twos here. I feel like either you're about to have this blessed new beginning financially, like a new business. We have the three of ones here, which is manifestation, what you've manifested. The things that you've been creating, dreaming of, wishing for, hoping for. The collaborations that you've been doing. It could be collaborating with your own energy or with another person here. Because I feel collaborative spirit here with all of the tools coming together in alignment. Someone may want to work with you. Um, so because of this, possibly there's a new beginning okay, in wealth. That's the Ten of Pentacles. That is everything. That's multiple streams of income. That is a joy and a abundance this is prosperity new income streams as well new things um coming to light being happy and glorious having that wonderful new beginning a lot to be thankful for we have three tens out on the board so a lot there's a lot of cycles um there are cycles ending closing out you're moving away from certain things 
and they're starting new new feelings within you new money new stability a new sense of self here i like this for you there could be soulmate energy here on the board as well two people that are attracting one another we have king and queen of wands okay so that could be soulmate energy as if you could have a lot of love uh a love attention around you right now a lot of interest love interest i mean to see you could have got a lot of love interest around you but um i just i see you're focusing mainly on you and there's one person over here that you're attracted to so yeah yeah girl i mean our boy or man woman okay we're gonna leave this reading here i wanted it to be a mini reading cancer but there you go <laughs> thank you for being here i do hope i'm gonna do another reading after this anyway but i do hope you found messages here that resonate with you sometimes the reading takes me all over the place that's how it goes um so i hope you found little messages here that inspire you and are able to help you along your journey if you did leave me a little treat behind you know, that's your little gesture of leaving a little compliment behind by giving me a thumbs up. You can share this video with those that you love and subscribe to my channel for future uploads. That is greatly appreciated. All of your support is appreciated. If you'd like to support my channel in other ways, can say in the description box below. I have details about that. If messages here resonate with you and you'd like a personal intimate reading done, just for you details for that in the description box below as well as always cancer remember that you can be do have everything and anything in this world that you desire because you're all and all is within you much love take care bye